Welcome to the ELHD quick video on how to place a new order on PowerChart within Cerner. This can be used to order tests, scans, procedures, follow-ups and referrals. Before we can place a new order on the system, we need to ensure we have the correct patient selected. To view your patient details, look in the blue banner displayed across the screen. In the components menu, we need to select a new order entry. Ensure that we have selected the correct option, inpatient or discharge medication. Down below, you can see any favourites you have saved to the system, <clears throat> any public favourites, and also any shared favourites. In the search box here, start by typing the name of the order. This should display some results. For the training, I'm going to select a full blood count. You will now see this is populated in the orders for signature box as above. If we click on this, we will now be taken to the orders for signature box. Please check that the information requested is correct. And then further down, we're going to select modify details. So we can see looking at the order, it's got a blue circle with a cross in the middle. This shows that details are missing and need to be completed. To do this, click on the symbol. Any yellow fields you see are mandatory and need to be completed, as you can see here. Complete the boxes as required. In the collection priority field, select the option most appropriate for the patient. For the training, I'm going to select um, OP. Next, we're going to complete the collection date and time. If I put T in the box, it'll put today's date. And if I put N in the time field, it'll put the current time. Once completed, at the bottom of the screen, we're going to select sign. If I wish to view any orders placed within the system, if I scroll down to the plan and requested actions component, you can see any orders placed here, and we can also add more details if required. If I would like to view the order in more detail, I can move to the request and care plans section within the menu, find the full blood count, right click this, and select order information. If you wish to cancel the order, again, right click, and select cancel. It will ask you to enter a reason for the cancellation. And then at the bottom, select orders for signature. You can now see the order has been cancelled. Thank you for watching.